we have up next we have Sean O'Connor aka um oh my god the button on my phone um that would be local dingus aka Adam Driver let's get Sean in the house Sean Hello, hey, Sean. Hey, what's up? How we doing? Doing good. Um, but there is one thing that's kind of ailing me lately. If I could just vent real quick, if that's cool. Let's hear it. Cool. Um, so I know we've been hearing a lot about um, gifted kid burnout syndrome. And that's that's something I had too, because I'll, I'll never forget when I was in that class. You know, I was in I was in that English class in elementary school and I was reading Gulliver's Travels and the teacher stopped me and was like, whoa, hang on a sec. You read that sentence really, really fast. And I was like, I, I don't know, like, I guess, yeah. And they're like, how about, how about you join the gifted kids class? How about you join the advanced class? How about you, you sit in this velvet, in this velvet desk, you know? And that set up a lot of expectations for me, you know, like I thought I was going to be like an astronaut and just it turns out I was just kind of reading the golden compass a little bit faster than I, I usually would. And nowadays, yeah, I'm just so I'm so burnt out from people telling me that I have a gift, mm. you know, and um, yeah, and I just I keep doing just like I keep getting caught up in all these like weird these weird things, you know, like all these weird activities. And I don't remember the last time I picked up a book, if I'm being honest. But I don't, I don't know the last time I picked up a book. I mean, they, they're like, here you go. Here's the velvet classroom. All the walls are velvet. The desk is velvet. And, and you, you can, every, everyone quiet down. They're so quiet down so Sean can read the Golden Compass series for the entire class because he has a gift. I'm going to butt in. There's people in the comments are kind of asking about this. I am as well. There's someone in the background. What? There's someone behind you who's tied up and screaming. Well, that's the craziest thing about being a gifted kid. I mean, people expect you to answer all these questions all the time, and I don't always have the answers. I'll see what Sean says. Right. Like, we were reading The Giver in class, right? We were reading The Giver. And I raised my hand. I'm like, teacher, 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 teacher. I think the, the, the pill is making him less horny. And, and the teacher was like, very good, Sean. That's why you get a big velvet throne to study on. And the other kids sit on the floor. Right. Dude, you, 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 you have gifts. You have a gift, and and if, if they can't see that, if they can't see that, then you got. Sometimes you gotta make. Them. Okay. Well, the only thing I'm only thing I'm seeing is the guy in the background who's tied up. In Sorry. I'm seeing a guy in the background, and I can't. I'm sorry, I can't ignore it. He looks like he's suffering. Um. So, yeah, I guess I kind of did suffer as a gifted kid. Yeah, I mean, everyone expected so much out of me, and I just, I totally burned out by the time I was 14. And because I was book smart, people, you know, they tend to overlook some of the other underlying issues I had. Right, like, maybe, um, maybe you are about to murder this guy, or you have some sociopathy going on in your personality yeah i mean i guess i'm just burnt out you know there's just so many people expected so many things out of me i loved reading the giver i loved reading gulliver's travels i loved reading the golden compass series right and, and you know it's just i thought i was gonna be a, you know an astronaut or something and i guess i just have to settle for being a hedge fund manager after all okay sean well that's actually really um sad but at the same time really beautiful i've touched that who gave you who gave you that that that's this is mine whoa sorry um yeah no, kelly it was great to see you and uh, good to see you too a little burnt out 
uh, it's 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 great to be on the ladies who ranch mic. So yeah, you. Okay, well, uh, pause your vibes, and I'm gonna call the police. Yeah. Okay, good vibes only. Good vibes only. <laughs> Whoa, everyone, um, Sean Record this shit once might do some freaky stuff to that guy. Hopefully, hopefully, um, maybe they're just playing around and having fun together because it's COVID. It's like a vacation. <laughs> just kidding.